Hello everyone and welcome back to Dragon Age Origins. We are here with Bryn and Wynn and Alistair and Sten. Finally, 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 finally out of the fade. But we aren't done yet <clears throat> with this quest. We still have to face Uldred, who started this all this anyways. Yeah. So this is what we're going to do. We need to get the um, Litany of Adrala off of Niall's body. Uh, I just wanted to apologize for the video being late or not coming out last week, actually. I've just been extremely busy and had some editing difficulties with Fallout 76 roleplay. And it just prevented me from getting this uh, show out on time. So I apologize for that. Hopefully that won't happen again. But if it does, you know, well, that's just the way it is sometimes. Anyway, let's loot the Litany of Adrala off of there. And also, we can level up. So let's do that. Now, I was going to do something last time. I'm, I can't remember what it was, though. I was going to put something into something specific the next time I leveled. I, I think it was stealth. Yeah, hopefully I have enough I'm pretty sure I have enough dexterity to do stealth for a little while. Um, let's see. Let's see. I think I'm going to put some into constitution because... I really need to last longer. <laughs> All right. Um, and, and also, I guess I have to actually know some trap making in order to even use traps. I didn't realize that. I thought I could use traps um, with, you know, I thought that was just for making traps because it says, you know, it's called trap making. And the character has learned to construct basic traps and lures out of common components. So that's why I thought it was only for making traps. But apparently I can't even use traps. Because every time I have a trap in my inventory, it's it's grayed out. I can't use it. So I'm thinking I might have to put up one, at least one point into trap making in order to use the traps that I pick up. I don't know. I guess we'll see. I might want to put at least one point into survival eventually just because of certain quests that are in the future that I know about. Hmm. But for now, I think I'm going to put um, a point into master combat training. Yeah. All right. So it was sneak. It was sneak that I was going to get. Yeah. Or wait, let stealth, whatever. Yeah. Stealth. I haven't really done much archery. I wanted to put some points into archery just so that I could have the option. Like if we're fighting a dragon or the emboss, I'll probably want to be an archer in those instances. Um, but yeah, for now, I'm just going to do stealth because I really could have used it during the fade. Yeah, but I couldn't. So. Stealth. All right, and nobody else has leveled, so unfortunately. Now we have some, I believe we have some injuries. Yes, I do. I have an aura of weakness. Hmm. And uh, no, 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 I want to look at Wynn. She doesn't have any. Um, Neither does Alistair. Sten does. He has a cracked skull. Poor Sten. Okay. So I will heal me and Sten. Um, I need a injury kit. No, I need a lesser injury kit. What would you like? And Sten, you need a lesser injury kit as well. Possible. It is possible. What are you talking about? <laughs> All right, so now we've got we've got to go to the next level to the next area. Let's take a look at the map. 
Yeah, okay, we need to go to the harrowing chamber, right? That's the very, very top of the tower. So, very, very top floor. So let's go do that. Let's check this room, make sure there's nothing in here. I still have that... It's probably a spell, actually, that's on me. So, um, I wonder if Alistair can dispel that um, by... Well, no, not sustained spells. We need ta not talents either, I don't think. Talents? Well, I guess maybe talents. Taunt, shield bash, shield pummel, cleanse area. Alright. No, I still have it. Hmm. Quickly. Uh, well, okay. I'm gonna take a look at it again. Um, aura of Weakness. I think that's a, a spell that was cast on me at one point, but I don't know how to get rid of it. I wonder what it does to me. Well, it seems like my damage... Per I don't know what the little symbols down there mean. There's nine for armor, right? 57 for, or is that 9 for armor protection? What's the 57 for? With the shield, is that armor protection? Or damage protection? Then there's 73 from the sword total. Um, the one underneath it is my individual weapons, what they make each individually, and then the one with the little person on it at the bottom, that's... what is that? My stamina, probably? Which it has a negative. I'm assuming the red means it's in the negative. So I'm... I, I have a penalty to stamina and damage protection, I'm thinking? I'm not sure what the difference between the helmet and the shield is. That... so the, the helmet might be my armor rating. The shield might be my damage protection. I don't know. I don't know. The shield might be my... My... Health? I, I really don't know. So, it is affecting me. I don't know how much. I don't know what... I don't know if those red numbers are... Like... The numbers with the penalty... Or if it's the default numbers, but showing the penal showing that it has a penalty, but not telling me what it is, it's really hard to tell. <sighs> it's really hard to tell. I mean, my health is up there, right, where that heart is, 185, and I'm guessing that the other one, the 181, is my stamina. So that's not my health down there. Ugh, it's confusing. Yeah. Oh, well, I guess I'll just have to deal with it. What did you just do, Win? You just cast rock armor on yourself for some reason. Okay. Whatever. Um, so Alistair couldn't cleanse the area of my s of the spell that I, that I have on me. Uh, unfortunately. A soldier corpse. Oh, good. A health cultist. We need them because I think we have what? How many do we have? We have three lesser, and now we have three regular ones. Hopefully we can actually uh, keep a hold of those. So is this the door we need to go through? Let's get to the middle. Um, no, this way? Oh, there's stuff to loot in here. Or I probably couldn't open this chest last time. Think again. Yeah. Next time I level, I'll put a point into that. Okay, we have to go all the way back around to get to the... Well, this goes down. Where's the... Where's the actual... Oh, I'm confused. This goes down to the third level. We need to get over to the... Okay. No, it said it's down here. Except there's a wall here. 
Can I go through this side now? Because the... Maybe I can. Oh, there's a thing I didn't loot. Magic staff. Ah! Oh, that's a dragon! Or it's a, it's a dragonling. A drake. Oh dear. How did they get in here? You guys, attack it! How did How did it get in here? Can I stun it? Nope. It stunned me. There it goes. Okay. This is a baby dragon. A drake scale and a potent health poultice. Nice. So yeah, we can- so we never actually went in this room. Hmm. So we can uh, take that to a certain place and get a uh, drake- dragon scale armor made. I wanted to look at that uh, the, liberation, the libertarian's cowl for a mage. Okay, can Wynne wear that? She's got a cowl on already, but... Ooh. I like this cowl. You wear that instead. <laughs> it has mana regeneration in combat. And that is... It doesn't have much, but any little bit helps, right? The Legend of Callanhad, Chapter 2. I find a note in a book. Desire and need. Note of censure. Have I read this before? No, I didn't. This is the new one. Templar Drass. Your remarks in front of the recruits are only the latest in a series of troubling events. I am beginning to suspect that you may not be suited to the devotional requirements of training. Perhaps it is time for a personal evaluation of your career path within the Templars. I will schedule some time after the current deployment to discuss options elsewhere in the organization. Attendant Serend, Assistant to Knight Commander Gregor. That's probably not worth our time at all. Is this where they take baths at? Well, no, this is where they wash the clothes. There's a washing board there. But that looks like a bathtub. Maybe they do both in the same places. It's not very private for bath, for bathing, is it? Of course, none of their other stuff was private. All right. Dragons are not to be toyed with. More drake. Oh, these are dragonlings. Okay, Stan, just get right in there. Right? Can I stun dragon wings? Yes, I can. Nice. Come on, get him. Okay. I seem to be missing a lot. They, they were squeaking. <laughs> I don't get to loot any of them, seriously. Ah, oh, what else do we have down here? More Drake scales and a beef bone for the dog. Finished. All right, I'll take it. The dog doesn't really need gifts because he's already at max affinity but you know whatever it's nice to give the dog a bone once in a while yeah what is this for why is there this like little fenced off area in here do these open and we just can't open them but then why is there nothing in there i don't understand the design of this place to be honest <laughs> Uh, sloth abomination. Oh, one, two.
ja, 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 ja. Is that soldier corpse? Crossbow. <gasps> the inventory is full. That's right, I had to dump a bunch of stuff last time. Well, I don't really need a crossbow. I don't like them. They're not very good weapons. But what what game has a crossbow that is actually good? I am done. A trade manifest. Hmm. So the inventory count doesn't count um, potions, uh, health potions, and lyrium potions. It does count. Um, uh, no. So it counts weapons, armor, necklaces. It does count bombs and um, these other things, venom, you know, that kind of stuff. It doesn't count health potions or lyrium potions, though, which is a good thing. It does count all this stuff, spirit shards and stuff like that. It counts runes and gifts, I think. I think I could probably drop some of these gifts. I don't need all these. Ugh, there's a lot of stuff in here. Anyway, I'm gonna, I am going to drop a few things, um, just because I don't need a lot of this stuff, and I want room to pick up things that I can actually make money on. <laughs> All right, there. Got some more space now. All right, and you know what? I should probably make a save right here, so I'm gonna do that again. There. <clears throat> now we are set. For a little while. I thought I looted that already. Oh, alright, that's right. I had a crossbow. I'll take it for now. I'll always I can always drop it later if I really need to. A base. Nature cell. Ah, oh, look at this. Look at all that. That's beautiful stuff. Beastman's dagger. I should take a look at that. And some mooney. It's over. Yeah, let's take a look at that dagger see if it's any better than any of mine oh it's um requires quite a bit of dexterity and it has um actually I'm compare it to my dagger um yeah wow it's better than my dagger i definitely want to save this it has two rune slots i just need to up my dexterity can't remember what i have Dexterity-wise, uh, whoops, wrong button. Um, where's my, where does it show my dexterity? Where does it actually show what dexterity I have? I don't know if it does anywhere. I honestly don't know. Oh, no, right here, duh. 22, I have 22 dexterity. Um, so... What was that one? 24. So next time I level, I'm going to put points into dexterity and then I'll be able to use that dagger. That would be nice. Okie dokie. Any foul fiends in here? Oh, there's a... Is that a globe? What is that? Ah! That's a rage demon. Ah! And another thing. And more things. Oh my god. There's are everywhere. Okay. That's not nice. A yes. Wind Ready. needs some. Uh, let's see, Lyrium potion. Lesser. Let, you know, let's use the big one. <laughs> there. Ow! My bruises are all bruised now. Your bruises are all bruised. Okay, Alistair. Um, 
we need to get you uh, uh, what's it called? Lesser injury kit. Yep. The yep. waiting around part is awesome. <laughs> Be cautious. What? I'm trying to get back to me. There, there we go. So now, what do you have on you? Do you have the same thing I had? I don't seem to have it anymore. Um, let's take a look. Snow. So, okay, that's your threaten. Okay, that's fine. I don't have him set yet to deactivate that after battle's over. Um, so let's level up Win. This is actually the first time we're leveling Win since we got her in our party. All right. So Win has Spirit Healer. So let's put some into magic. Let's put it all into magic for now. We'll, we'll do more somewhere else later. All right, so she's a spirit healer. She has group heal and revival, which is nice. Life ward. Oh, the caster places a protective ward on an ally that automatically restores health when the ally falls close to death. That's nice. Yeah. So this restores health to all nearby allies every few seconds and curing the injuries of allies very close to the caster. But you only get injuries if you go down in battle. Hm. What is this? Arcane shield? Which might be nice for her. Hmm. Let's see what else we've got over here. Flame blast. Winter's grass. I do want to get the, the frost spells for her because those are really helpful so she's got all of these things mass rejuvenation what's this heroic defense and this is glyph of paralysis that's kind of interesting spell wisp that's kind of weird okay spirit Spell shield, mana drain, walking bomb, huh. mind blast. Mind blast is really good to have in uh, Dragon Age 2. I know I used to use it all the time. I don't know how good it is in this one. Entropy sort of seems like the opposite of a spirit healer. <laughs> so, um, you know what? I'm going to start on Winter's Grass. Well, the winter, uh, you know. Yeah, ice, whatever. I'm going to start on that because I really want Wynn to have more um, defensive spells. Or offensive, I should say. Good, three more health poultices. That's awesome. What now? And another Lyrium potion oh. and a lightning rune. Okay, cool. So this is the one to the stairs. Yes. Ew. It's a Templar. Hey. Oh. Gotta have a save, I guess. It is a Templar. Cullen. This trick again? I know what you are. It won't work. I will stay strong. Hmm. Are you alright? The boy is exhausted. And this cage... Uh I've never seen anything like it. Rest easy. Help is here. Uh, enough visions! If anything in you is human, uh, kill me now and stop this game! You broke the others, but I will stay strong for my sake. Flaubert's filthy blood mages getting in my head. Uh, I will not break. I'd rather die. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Calm down. You're safe now. Silence! I'll not listen to anything you say. Now be gone! Still here. But that's always worked before. I close my eyes, but you are still here when I open them. Um. <clears throat> 
I'm real, and I'm here to help you. Don't blame me for being cautious. The voices, the, the images, so real. Did Gregor send you? How? How did you get here? Yes. Yeah, no. I'm a Grey Warden, and I'm trying to help save the tower. Good. Kill Aldred. Kill them all for what they've done. They caged us like animals. Looked for ways to break us. I'm the only one left. Wow. Be proud. You mastered yourself. Be proud? What is there to be proud of? That I lived and they died? They turned some into monsters and... Oh, there was nothing I could do. Hmm. Where are Irving and the other mages? What others? What are you talking about? Irving and the other mages who fought Aldred. Where are they? They are in the harrowing chamber. The sound's coming up from there. Oh, Mega. We must hurry. They are in grave danger, I am sure of it. Indeed. You can't save them! You don't know what they've become. Hmm. We can't just kill them all. They've been surrounded by, by blood mages whose wicked fingers snake into your mind and corrupt your thoughts. His hatred of mages is so intense. The memory of his friend's deaths is still fresh in his mind. You have to oh, end indeed. it now, before it's too late. <clears throat> I want to save everyone who can possibly be saved. Are you really saving anyone by taking this risk? To ensure this horror is ended. To guarantee that no abominations or blood mages live. You must kill everyone up there. <laughs> I cannot decide that before seeing what's going on. That is your choice to make, but I beg you to consider what I have to say. You cannot tell Maleficarum by sight. Just one could influence the mind of a king, of a grand cleric. Hmm. Okay, well... I've made my decision. I will wait and see. Make her turn his gaze on you. I hope your compassion hasn't doomed us all. Yeah. I'm not just going to agree to kill everybody on site. I want to see who's up there. We have to at least rescue Gregor. Or he's going to come and kill everybody who's in this tower who's a mage. That includes Wyn and those other mages that were down there that Wyn was with. They won't spare anybody. So we need to at least get Gregor. Anyway. All right. Here we go, you guys. Here we go. Into the harrowing chamber. Hopefully we have enough uh, <laughs> potions for this. Oh, yeah. There's Gregor. Do you accept the gift that I offer? That evil. Ugh. Yeah, because why would anybody actually want to be one of those? Hello. Ah, look what we have here. An intruder. I bid you welcome. Care to join in our revels? <clears throat> I take it you're Aldred. Oh, very observant. I'm quite impressed you're still alive. Unfortunately, that must mean you killed my servants. 
Ah, oh, well, they are probably better off dying in the service of their betters than living with the terrible responsibility of independence. His voice is really familiar. He's from... He voices somebody in Skyrim, doesn't he? I can't place it, though. Oh man, that's gonna drive me nuts. If you guys know, let me know in the comments. <laughs> okay. Hmm. No, you're turning these people into abominations. And freeing them in the process. Uh huh. A mage is but the larval form of something greater. Larval form? Your gentry vilifies us, calls us abominations when we have truly reached our full potential. Uh-huh. Look at them. The Chantry has them convinced. They deny themselves the pleasure of becoming something glorious. You're mad. There's nothing glorious about what you've become, Aldred. <laughs> Aldred? He is gone. I am Aldred, and yet not Aldred. I am more than he was. I could give you this gift to win. You and all the mages. It would be so much easier if you just accepted it. Mm. But some people can be so stubborn. Oh my gosh, his voice is just driving me nuts. Who is he? <laughs> now I'm now I'm questioning whether he's in Skyrim or if he's in Assassin's Creed. I don't know. It's like it's right on the edge of my brain and I just can't put my finger on it. Okay. Well. Uh, say what you like, Aldred. I'm still going to kill you. Resistance. Everywhere I go, resistance. How very inconsiderate. I even have the first enchanter on my side. Don't I, Irving? What have you done to him? Stop him. He is building an army. He will destroy the Templars. And you're a sly little fox, Irving, telling on me like that. And here I thought he was starting to turn. Never. Hmm. That's enough out of you, Irving. He'll serve me eventually, as will you. <clears throat> no. No, I won't. I'd rather die than serve you. Killing you would be a waste. Your raw potential, with the strength of a demon behind it, would be unstoppable. I can do that. I can give you power and a new life. Yeah. That doesn't sound very appealing to me. I don't think your opinion matters. <laughs> oh. That is what I've decided, and that is what will be done. Okay. Fight, if you must. It will just make my victory all the sweeter. Don't forget the litany. It will thwart Aldred's attempts to control the mages and win this fight for us. Yeah. Okay. Oh, great. I need to put the litany... Is the litany in my... Yeah, there it is. Okay. Um, let's use it right now. Here we go. Okay, let's kill these abominations first. I shall... Where are you going? Okay, I need to keep track of everybody's health. As you say. Use it now. Here, I'll use it on these guys. I don't. There we go. So he's controlling their minds. Oh, I just totally. Oh no, Alistair! No, no, no. 
So when right orders, he's gonna die. He is so gonna die before Win can actually heal him. I'm just gonna I give him a. I'm gonna give him a potion. So we do have six. No, we have a lot more potions now. So Alistair, no. He died before he could take it. That's unfortunate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Litany. Here we go. What kind of As you say. deal is he doing? Down. Oh my gosh, so both of my tanks are down. I wasn't watching them. So you doing the litany of a draw lot. Get win! Win! Oh no. That's not good. I am ready. Um, no, yeah, I want it on win. Okay. Um, she can't currently take a health poultice. Because she's, because she's in the middle yeah. of dying, that's why. Oh, that's not good. I'm gonna die now. Enough. Yeah, I'm gonna die now. I, well, you know what? Let's just start over. Yeah, we got him down past half. I don't know if he has different forms or not. I can't remember if he has different forms. Okay. Just um, stop chasing me, would ya? Dude. Sleep. I shall do it. Alright, we got him. All right, you know what? Let's give Win Where now? a potion. Lyrian potion. Yeah, one of these. Let's make this quick. Is it now? Is it now? Is it now? Okay. I'm back to win another potion. Needs another potion. Ready. I'm doing it manually because I don't want her to use them all up before the fight is over, and she will. She totally will. Win Hill, Alistair, please. Win Hill, Alistair. No, she didn't do it in time. Okay, I need to use Litany of Adrala. Nobody die while I'm doing this, please. All right, win. Let's get you another yes. potion. We are out of the good ones. Now, get up, quick! Oh, I'm frozen. I'm frozen, and I'm going to die. I'm frozen, and I'm going to die. Win. Can you please heal me? Immediately. Yeah. I died. Okay. Alright. Well. I'm going to I'm going to stay on wind so that I can potion her up easier. Try that again. Oh no, there's a... Uh... Oh, I missed it! One of them turned into a... Mm. I missed it, darn it. Sorry, sorry. I did not mean... Oops. I mean to... I want to cast that. I'm pushing wrong buttons! <sighs> okay, you know what? I'm just going to get it from here because <laughs> I don't want to unpause the thing. Heal. There. I want to cast it on you. Oh wow, that barrel. Oh no. We are so dying. <laughs> we are so dying. I can't cast it again yet because. Yeah. No. 
Okay, I, she's got me in. Crushing prison! Okay, that's wonderful. Well, you know what? <laughs> At least the cutscene wasn't before it wasn't uh, after the save. I need to use the litany. I gotta get up first. Get up! Quick! 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 Okay. This prevents them from turning into more abominations. Oh, I need to use it again. Quick! Get up! Get up! Get up! Get up! I can't use it yet. Oh, hopefully they don't turn into abominations before I can use it again. Almost. No! Litany! Litany! Oh, it didn't work. Fast enough. I had to wait for it to recharge and it didn't recharge it fast enough. Oh, Alistair and them are dead now. No, you stay away from Gwen. You stay away from Gwen. Gwen, take a potion. Now she's Alright. I doubt I'm gonna be able to save those people. I can't. I'm in. Okay. I got in crushing prison. So he uses crushing prison. Ugh. Okay. I gotta be quicker for on the. Uh... Alistair's already dead! <sighs> That's annoying. Oh, it didn't work! Because I got frozen! Ah, darn it! Yeah, whatever. <laughs> whatever! <sighs> Man, he does a lot of damage with each, with, with each hit. He sure does. Okay. No, oh, I'm in crushing prison! Get out of there, quick! Thank you, Anne, for keeping me alive. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, let's give you a potion. Okay. Use it now, okay. No, I fell over. Get up quick! When use use Gwen needs Where to use now? a potion again. I hear you. I just need to give you a potion. Direct me. Yes. Uh, is he? Uh, yes, he is. Okay. It shall be done. Go. Uh, uh, oh, get up quick. Win. Win, win, win. How am I 
I gonna use it? Okay. You know what? Wayne can use it. Wayne can use it. Okay. Give her a potion. Um. Yeah. Who should I heal first? <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna switch to Alistair. I'm gonna play Alistair. Oh, he's as you wish. Oh no! Oh no 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 no! Win, heal him, heal him, heal him right now, please. Quick, heal him. Keep him healed. Keep him healed. Keep him healed. Keep him healed. Direct me. I need you to. Oh man, we're running out. Okay. Okay. Good. 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 Oh no! Whoa! We got him. Ah. Oh. Whoa! Yeah. We did it! <laughs> Good, he didn't have any other farms! Cinderfell gauntlets inscribed, and look at all that money! Wowzers! You guys, we did it! Where'd the other mages go? Did they die? That was the one that turned into an abomination. Where'd the other ones go? Oh, they're right here. Oh my gosh, you guys, we did it! All right, let's talk to First Enchanter Irving. Oh, Maker, I'm too old for this. Irving, are you all right? I've been better, but I am thankful to be alive. I suppose that is your doing, isn't it, Win? I wasn't alone. I had help. The Circle owes both of you a debt we will never be able to repay. Come. The Templars await. We shall let them know that the Tower is once again ours. Yes, um, actually I would like to look around before we leave. All right, but please hurry. Gregor should be informed of what happened here as soon as possible. Indeed, he shall be. He shall be indeed, but I wanted to check and make sure that there wasn't anything to loot in here. Actually, it doesn't look like there is, so... Okay. Well, that's too bad. Er, no. Why is there a fence around the outer part of this tower and there's not actually a way to get over there? Like, you can't... Yeah. This looks just like the top of the Tower of Ishal. Hm. Okay, I thought we would be able to loot something, but no, we cannot. Okay, First Enchanter Irving. Are you ready to leave yet? We should tell the Templars about what went on here. Yes, we should go now. I'll need you to guide me down the stairs. Ugh. Curse whoever insisted the Circle be housed in a tower. Ah, <laughs> yeah. Irving? Maker's breath. I did not expect to see you alive. It is over, Gregor. Aldred is dead. Aldred tortured these mages, hoping to break their wills and turn them into abominations. We don't know how many of them have turned. What? Don't be ridiculous. Of course he'll say that. He might be a blood mage. Don't you know what they did? I won't let this happen again. I am the Knight Commander here, not you. Yes. I believe order has been restored to the Circle. We will rebuild. The Circle will go on, and we will learn from this tragedy and be strengthened by it. We have won back the Tower. I will accept Irving's assurance that all is well. But they may have demons within them, lying dormant, lying in wait. Enough. I have already made my decision. Thank you. You have proven yourself a friend of both the Circle and the Templars. Hmm. Yes. Okay. <clears throat> and what about the Dorks bomb? I require aid. I promised you aid. 
But with the circle restored, my duty is to watch the mages. They are free to help you, however. Speak uh, to them. Of course. Yes, and what will the Templars do? For now, I will have to oversee a sweep of the tower. There may be some survivors, and we should do our best to tend to them. Please excuse me. And Irving, it is good to have you back. Ah, I'm sure we'll be at each other's throats again in no time. <laughs> All right. Um, hmm. All right. Let's talk to... Well, let's talk... Here we are. Oh, okay, the I guess we're talking to him. in disarray. The circle nearly annihilated. Oh, it could have been much, much worse. I am hmm. glad you arrived when you did. It's almost as though the Maker himself sent you. Yes. The Blight drove me here to seek aid. Actually, first it was the Arl demon is sick and his son is possessed by demons. <laughs> That's what came, made me come here first. No, but I'm glad I could help. From what Gregor said, it seems that you came here seeking allies. The least mm -hmm. we can do is help you against the Darkspawn. I would hate to survive this, only to be overcome by the Blight. Indeed, yes. <clears throat> but what? But there are so few mages left. Do not underestimate <clears throat> us. Even one mage will be a great help to you. You have my word, as first enchanter. The Circle will join the Grey Wardens in the fight. Hmm. Irving, I have a request. I seek leave to follow the Grey Warden. Win, we need you here. The Circle needs you. I appreciate the sentiment, Irving. But the Circle will do fine without me. The Circle has you. This woman is brave and good, and capable of great things. If she will accept my help, I will help her accomplish her goals. Yes, I would be honored to have you join me, Win. You were never one to stay in the tower when there was adventure to be had elsewhere. Why stay when I can be of service elsewhere? Then I give you leave to follow the Grey Warden. But know that you always have a place here. There is much to be done here, mm. and I must go. You must forgive me for not being a proper host. <laughs> um, actually, I had another favor to ask of you. Can the circle go to Redcliff to save a possessed child? The child is possessed, but... Killing the demon would mean killing the... Unless you intend to enter the Fade. Yeah, unfortunately. Yes. <laughs> yes, it can be done with a group of mages. I shall gather what mages I can, and we shall leave promptly. A life is at stake. Oh, thank you. Indeed. Win approves, plus seven. More? <laughs> More, uh... Fade stuff, Unfor unfortunately, but luckily it's not going to be nearly as long. Can we talk to Colin? I wish I could have gone with them to fight. With the mages? That's nice of you to think that. Is the quartermaster still here? Good. Oh, actually, before I talk to him, I'm going to see if anybody can use any of the stuff we've picked up. Wrong button. Always doing that. Um... Yeah, no, uh, so there was... What did we pick up? We picked up some sort of a... Some sort of something, right? Was it armor? Cinderfell gauntlets, that's what it was. For a mage, of course. Plus 20% fire damage. Well, that's not bad. Let's take a look at this. Wynn is wearing... Yeah, okay. Charged mitts, which has plus 10% electricity damage. Let's give her the Cinderfell gauntlets. And then uh, we'll give uh, Morrigan the other ones. Okay. 
And um, don't think there's anything else here. Archon robes. I was going to give these to... Yeah. I was going to give those to... Uh, what's uh, Morgan as well. So... All right, let's take a look at everything. Um, I don't think this is better. No, it's not. Scale armor, that's not better either. I'm just checking everything, making sure. Okay. And I believe you are wearing, what are you wearing? You're wearing chain mail, heavy chain mail. Okay. No, we don't have anything in here that's as good as that. Except this Templar helm, which he cannot wear yet. Um, you can. You can wear it. Hmm. I mean, hmm. Let's just save it for now, I guess. Okay. So... I want to give him this greatsword eventually. Uh, he needs to get more strength first, though. Yeah. Alright, well, looks like we can't actually equip anything. Actually, fire resistance plus 10% to healing effects received. That might actually be good for you. Shiver? Hmm. Hmm. Do you have? No, you don't. Let's give that to you too. Sailor's charm, electricity resistance, and charm of still waters plus one willpower. What is? You, what do you have on? Hmm. Okay. What's that again? Yeah. What am I wearing? Amulet of Accord. Yeah. I don't think the. Reduce hostility works. Everything always comes straight for me anyways. <laughs> Alright, you guys. Um, I am going to trade with the quartermaster, get some of this junk out of our, our inventory before we head out. You really killed all those abominations? Yeah. I didn't think it was possible. I thought we'd all die here. I'm sure you need supplies after that, don't you? <laughs> yes, a lot of supplies. All right. I will quickly sell everything and then I will take a look at the shop and uh, we'll see if he has anything new or whatever. Yeah. Okay. Everything that I can sell, I sold. And he's got a full set of chain mail made out of viridium. I'm thinking of buying it. I mean, what's the point of having money if I don't spend it, right? <laughs> I mean, I could just save up all of the money that I ever earn and never spend it, but then what point is there in that? So he's got these chainmail gloves, chainmail boots. Well, I guess that's splint mail boots. But still, they're better than mine. And I'm currently wearing splint mail boots. They are um, better than mine. They're tier four. Um, then the chainmail gloves, definitely better than mine. And then the chainmail. So, I'm thinking I might. I don't know. Like, I, 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 it's hard for me to decide if I want to buy the armor that I use or if I just want to wait and find it. But I might never find it, right? Or I might not find it until, like there's even better stuff that I can wear in shops, but I'm just not finding it, you know what I mean? So, I don't know. I'm thinking I'm going to buy it. And then I can give Liliana my current armor, and then I can sell this stuff that I was saving for her. Um, yeah, I think I might do that. I think I might. All right. I'll do it. I'll do it. So there's some heavy chainmail boots too. I don't remember if Alistair has chainmail boots. Hmm. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, yeah. I'm going to go ahead and buy this chainmail viridium and chainmail gloves viridium and where'd it go? Splintmill 
boots viridium all right that's a lot that's a lot that is for sure a lot you guys Ugh. what are these mm, that's nothing good Those... yeah that's basic stuff all right so then we've got do we have any good uh, mages stabs Ooh, staff of the magister lord that's crazy wow and it's also costs like all the money in the game <laughs> right all right do you have any health potions or ingredients you do have health potions i don't i'd rather buy the ingredients well hmm injury kit recipe we already have that um Lyrium dust. Then we could make lyrium potions with it. Let's get some. Um, hmm. How many should we buy? Let's buy 20. And. They don't have any elf fruits? Uh huh. Well, that's no fun. Fine. Ooh, a backpack. Oh my gosh, it's going to use up all the rest of my money. But it's worth it, you guys. It so is. There we go. There we go. Okay. No more. We can't buy anything else. Bye. <laughs> Let's put on this new armor, actually. Let's see what it looks like. It probably looks just like this. Ugh! There we go again. <laughs> Apparently I'm not the only one who does that. Some of you guys have mentioned that you do that, too. So, put on the chainmail gloves, and the splintmail boots, and the chainmail. It's brown. Okay, well that's alright. That's alright. Alright, there we go. All set. And, uh, I think this is where we're going to leave, um, this is where we're going to leave this episode today, you guys. I know it's not as long as they've been lately, but that's mainly because lately um, <laughs> the battles have run on long and I would rather not have the episodes be an hour and a half long, which is they've been recently, but I don't want them to be because I just don't have time to record that much in one sitting. Um, oh, you know what I didn't do? I didn't take a health oh, no wrong button um wrong direction i should say a injury kit no i cannot to heal my injury and i don't know if anybody else needs one somebody might need one yeah sten is deafened and, and alistair okay just sten as usual me and sten <laughs> There you go. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah, that's where we're going to to end this episode today, you guys. Well, at least that fight wasn't as difficult as the one with the sloth. With sloth. Uh, yeah. Those fights in the fade. <clears throat> we actually only died, what, four times? Three or four times? I can't remember. Three or four times. So that wasn't too bad. And it definitely helps to micromanage everybody yeah so um yeah if you liked the episode leave uh, me a like and i'm not sure where we're gonna go after this well no i i do know next episode we're going to be heading back to red cliff and we're going to um you know help connor yeah that's what we're going to do so Hope you guys look forward to that, and I will see you then. Until then, remember to play safe, play nice, and have fun. All right? Bye, everybody.